My name is Michael Ampofu Boati, an electrical and electronics engineering major at the Chelsea University class of 2022. So my project is an automatic meal dispenser for household dogs and it works in the sense that it's able to deliver food, um, water and medication to your dogs and then give you an alert on the temperature of the food as well as the water levels and also tell you if your dog is eating well or not, um, judging by the weight of the bowl and with the food in it. This is the printed circuit board and on it I have all the different components that I'm using. And here is the relay. The relay controls the different components that are 12 volts. So for example, this LED strip is also controlling the 775 motor fan. It's controlling the glow plug, which is used for heating. And it's controlling some other things too as well. So here is the RTC clock so that I can know specific times to feed the dog. The OLED display shows the times as well as a bitmap image of the dog bowl when the time is right and then a back converter steps down the power that's received from the back so it's a plug-in the user has to plug it in and at the top here this is where you put your food and this is where you put your water and then this top here is a cooling system so at the back the fans that are on it's the cooler that is cooling the system so to finally be dispensed here this is where it's heated this is where it's mixed and this servo controls the medicine that's to be put into the food and finally the food will come out through this track. And here's where the water comes out through using these holes, the water sensor, and finally it displays it on the software. This is the software. There are four softwares that control the machine. The first one is the app. The app controls um, the specific amount of food you want to give to the dog, the type of dog that you have, and then when you want to actually give it food. And then the second software that I have here I use HTML, CSS, PHP, and then MySQL. This uh, measures the temperature of the food that is being delivered, as well as the water level. And it can also send you a Gmail alert too as well, because sometimes perhaps the user will not be able to go directly to the web page. They want to receive the alert when the dog is fed. And then finally, the weight of the bowl will be displayed here. That will give you the weight of the actual amount of food that has been given to the dog as well as a graph for the water level. Here is the app. I called it the Pet Mix app. And as soon as you open it, you have three different options. You can use voice control to actually feed the dog directly. By uttering the words feed now, it's able to feed your dog directly. Or perhaps you would want to actually select the specific amount of food. So you go to let's do it. So say you have a German Shepherd because they have specific amounts of food that they are supposed to eat. So you go to next. And here you select the different food combinations. There's option one, option two, and option three. And then let's say I select this one. So then the feeding times, once daily, twice daily, or thrice daily. And finally, you select the time that you want to give the dog food. And then if you want to give it a diwema, yes or no. And finally, you're able to view the analytics. So then you can go to finish. And finally, you have the quick functions. Here you're able to put on and off the device initiate pet calling so at a specific frequency the dog will be able to come in here and then start eating the food the water now function helps you to be able to give the dog water right when you press that button so these are just some quick functions and finally cancel program when you want to cancel the time that you're giving the dog food maybe you want to change it again using the quick functions i can control um, the automatic pet feeder using different ways so for example if i want water to come out this is how water will come out. So you can see water coming out down there. And then I can put it off finally. So that's how water comes out of the machine. This is the pet calling function. So specifically, you're supposed to alert dogs at a specific frequency, but I thought it would be boring. So perhaps I reduce the frequency so that human beings can hear it. I'm now going to show how it's going to feed your dog. So let's say I pick a German Shepherd and it's one year old. And then maybe I want dry food to be fed once daily at 1331. Do I want Diwema? Let me say no. And finally finish. So at this specific time, you to deliver food. So after heating, it mixes clockwise, anti-clockwise, and finally the food will be dispensed. So that's how it works.